What up, Melvin7 here, and today I'm bringing you a 500k squad builder. Now, let's get straight into this. This was requested by uh, one of my followers on Twitter, I believe, and uh, yeah, he wanted De Bruyne in it, so, I mean, you'll be able to tell by the thumbnail, but yeah, he's the main uh, priority in this team. Now, I did build it a few days ago, but because of foot champion squad builder challenges, you know, other videos kind of collide, so it might be a lot cheaper now. Although, well, well, we'll take a look. But anyway, uh, it, it was 500k, give or take, you know, 30 or so uh, when I bought it. But anyway, we've got Thiago Silva as the first centre-back. Obviously, we put Ruffier in net there. And uh, the other centre-back we've got is Marquinhos. Then we're going to have uh, our third PSG player and our fourth League One player. And that's going to be Serge Aurier. And that literally completes that section of the team. Then we're going to go to Calcio A, I believe it is, and uh, we're going to put Alexandro, a very solid player, of course, I'll go through it in the highlights as I always do. Uh, and then another Calcio, play, Calcio A player with some ridiculous stats, he's around 40k I think, 45k for Nangolan. Actually, I might as well show you what I, what I paid, 68k for Thiago Silva, Marquinhos is first owner but he's 1 to 2k, uh, Serge Aurier around about the same. Uh, Ruffier, you can probably get him for 3 4k now. I bought him ages ago. I think Sandro's about 10k, maybe slightly cheaper now. Was he more? No, oh, no, he's a bit more. He's about 12 to 13k. Uh, then we move over to the Premier League and we're going to have a screamer card and it's going to be Marwan Fellini, which is kind of fitting because for this weekend, of course, they get their mad upgrades. And uh, it seems as though he's actually rose from what he was when I bought him. Unless this is just people getting price, uh, maybe not. Yeah, slightly. What did I buy him for? About, well, no, I packed him. What an idiot. How did I forget that? But anyway, uh, yeah, yeah, I think he's about 80k or so. But anyway, the other midfielder we've got is going to be Kevin De Bruyne, of course, uh, with a Hunter chemistry style. But uh, yeah, I brought him ages ago for 248k. I think he's a little bit cheaper, not too much. But yeah, yeah, he's about 220, 230 um, so yeah, he has dropped in value from what I bought. Now, this player is one that you will have to have in your club. I mean, you can just use the left mid Sterling and put him on this side and, uh, you know, drop the chemistry ever so slightly, which I don't think it really harms the player too much. But we've got the, uh, the squad building challenge player of the month, Raheem Sterling there, uh, 84 rated right wing. Uh, up front, we've got... Daniel Sturridge, I've kind of gave that away before I even put him in, but yeah, uh, 89 pace Liverpool player who is uh, currently around 50k. And then the final player in this team, we go back to Calcio A, and I think he's a left wing. I wish they had a setting for left mid, left wing, all left uh, forward instead of having to individually choose the player. But anyway, we've got Dries Mertens there, so that completes the team, but how does it play in game? Alright, while I like most of these players individually, I just can't get the grips with this formation. I don't really think it's the team, I just think I don't like 4-3-2-1, but I'm trying to use a wide variety of formations because there'll be some that don't like my favourite formations, like 4-2-3-1. So, yeah, I want to try and use different varieties, even if I don't physically like it, because I think this team would be good for someone who likes 4-3-2-1. Like, the players in it, De Bruyne, Sturridge, De Mer uh, Mertens, Nangolan, they're all strong. You've got uh, Thiago Silva and Marquinhos, who kind of uh, complement each other quite well. Aurier, Sandro as fullbacks, and Fellini as, like, the, the midfielder with a bit of strength and, you know, who can run into the box and get some of the headers in. So, overall, it is a good team. I just wasn't a fan of it purely because of 4-3-2-1. But I think if you do like that formation, then this could be a very, very successful team. Sterling Merton's on the wing with Sturridge running off them. Ruffier in net. He's a really good goalkeeper as well. So, anyway, hopefully you have enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like the video. And, yeah, peace.